Hi guys, it's your boy Awom Kenneth. Like Awom Kenneth, E W O M Awom Kenneth, and I'm back again for another YouTube video. Yeah, I'm getting more serious with my YouTube shit. So today's video is going to be, um, as you can tell by the title already, how to be rich in Nigeria. Well, let me be truthful to everybody, and before I go on for that, you guys. Notice something. We are back at our former studio. <laughs> yeah, my father, my father's house. Um, yeah, this is the dining table. I was trying to be funny, but the joke did not work. Yeah. Anyway, so back to the topic. How to be rich as a Nigerian? Uh, if you're watching this video and <laughs> you're expecting to be rich by the end of this video brother <laughs> or sister kindly get behind me <laughs> anyway well first and first start by giving up because if you want to be rich in nigeria you have to start by giving up start by giving up start by thinking of all the negative things that are ever going to happen like even think of the ones that you never can ever think of that will happen to you when you start your business like ha, imagine but like let's see you're not even depending on nigerian light you're not even depending on nigerian water like you have um the stream like let's say you are selling water and you're not even doing bubble shit or anything like that you don't need water or generator you're just like fetching from the stream or even like water and packaging it one day, one day, you just wake up and you see that that water is flow through that gutter or that stream has stopped. <laughs> so first to first, start by discouraging yourself. Start by giving yourself all negative thoughts and ideas like whatever you think is going to happen bah, will happen in Nigeria when you start your business. Like minute details that you think, no, you can look over. One lie, it will happen like should be should to happen to you so start by giving yourself all negative thoughts and ideas and just just be depressed for like one week yeah then when you have gone through that stage then tell your parents and your family friends about this your business idea or idea of how you want to get rich then taking all their negative <laughs> Don't worry. When you have when you want to start something, nobody is ever going to support you. But if you're not doing anything, be like, ah, ah, your mates are working, your mates are dying. Oh, you're not ready now. Oh, I have this business idea. I want to start selling. But I want to start making. But ah, ah, the first thing will knock you. Ah, ah, there's no funds. Second thing, um, ah, that business self eh, get risk. So if you enter a man, ha, you go lose money tire. Hey, like they are gonna so bring you down. So just keep in mind your back of your mind that you are your own motivational videos. So your own motivational self. So um, is this is English English correct at all? What am I saying? Uh, yeah, just keep the mind back of your mind that you are motivating your own self yeah sorry i would eat this this morning so i have got her so uh -huh. where are we now so when you have told them about your idea <laughs> and you have finished uh, astrating your life with all their negative advices then pray to god no even pray to god first before, it's before my number one pray to god well then go through this stage then What's the next thing, Seth? Then start. If you can start, start. Don't wait till you get funds. Because you wait till you get funds. While lying, will come and meet you. <laughs> and you still be at the number one thing. So you have to do your parents. So if your business need 5 million to start, start when you have 10,000 10, there. Then which one is next? Why are you not start now? The first thing you need to get. Is not to employ anybody try and get a financial advisor like not your father not anybody close to you just get like one stranger from nowhere 
uh, be like telling him I don't have money blah 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 just I want advice then do YouTube videos when you get a financial advisor get um, an accountant the first person you employ is either an accountant that make a lawyer your best friend that make a chartered accountant your best friend too so when you get those best two best friends sorted out uh -huh. by that time you have gotten some other low dosage negative advice is like that from them too so but those ones will have some small positives because they want your money so they have to give you positive feedbacks uh -huh. so when you have gotten this product you last that employee when you're not employee ah brother give your life to christ <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry for like people that are not Christian. I will like give your life to the God you worship. Cause ah Woohoo Even if your best friend the minute you give somebody employment later ah, as if like one one spirit is like waiting seriously waiting to just start sending your weapons so just be prepared anything can happen even the person self your own ah yeah 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 best Ooh well lie something must happen it's either somebody's offended or they took somebody's bio <laughs> and the ball pen and the person vex i say i'm no more coming to work again uh, hey, people have short temper so that is like the best uh, hey, second problem that you have then what 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 next again what next again after you employ bar then you have passed the negative stage of employer are tired they're not doing the work you just basically eat your money and they're not keeping records of everything and you have passed that stage now you now enter the stage of rent because of like for that one year you're just spending money spending 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 money but if you're wise that one at first one month says you make money so i'm just giving you all the negatives so uh, hey you're not entitled to the rent issue if you know if your father is not rich enough to buy your your building sorry you will join a category a rent so when you finish renting now your landlord that finished dd with you <laughs> your eye will clear especially abuja landlords okay lagos lagos have pity because they know it's lagos but put your landlords as if they had the torch then after you finish landlord now you can enter into your business wahala either one agency from nowhere will just come up and give you oga come and pay license <laughs> or if you have guru accountant that didn't tell you that corporate tax is 30 percent of your income Then you now start figuring how you now bypass that that thirty percent, or you create an NGO. Then you send the money to an NGO, and uh -huh, then you fix it there. So that is okay. Let me just stop here, so that because this is getting like five minutes. I'll just stop here. And that corporate tax is thirty percent of your income. And uh -huh, then I will just rest inside you. Then if you can survive all these attacks. For like five years, bro. But I guess you're gonna become rich. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. Remember to subscribe to the channel and share. Please like or dislike. I don't really care. Comment whether you hate it or you don't like it or uh, leave all those negatives there. But if you are the child of God and you want to leave a positive, thumbs up, brother or sister. Thank you. We have to subscribe to the channel, please. I want to pay my house rent next month. No, I want to pay office rent, so I need assets money. <laughs> oh, God. Thank you, guys. Bye.